Hey guys, this is Paco Mino, and today I want to share a cool app that has been making rounds on Steam. I think you'll find this interesting. This is Wallpaper Engine. It cost me less than $3 and it enables you to use live wallpapers on your Windows desktop. Various types of wallpapers are supported, including 3D and 2D animations, websites, videos, and you can even run a Unity app in the background. You can choose a pre-existing wallpaper or you can be creative and make your own. The Steam Workshop is already buzzing with a lot of user-generated content, and the creative possibilities of this software is theoretically limitless. While there are a few cool submissions, unfortunately most of the content right now are anime or softcore hentai. Definitely not my cup of tea, but if that's what you're into, I won't judge. Here are the features of Wallpaper Engine. Aside from running real-time graphics and audio on your desktop, it also features interactive wallpapers that you can control with your mouse. Wallpaper Engine supports aspect ratio and native resolutions including 16x9, 21x9, 16x10, and 4x3. Multi-monitor users need not worry because Wallpaper Engine works just like Display Fusion when using more than one monitor. Wallpapers will pause while playing games or running intensive programs. You can use the Wallpaper Editor to make your own live wallpapers and it's super easy to import your own video files. The Steam Workshop integration will allow you to share and even sell your own wallpapers with the Steam community. On the powerful Steam platform, Wallpaper Engine will become bigger than any live wallpaper software ever created. Using the Wallpaper Editor, you can create 3D and 2D wallpapers by importing pictures or 3D models and textures. Video, web, and application wallpapers are created by simply importing your files into the editor and pushing them to the workshop as a wallpaper. All wallpapers on workshop are ready to use and can either be distributed for free or a price of your choice. I love how streamlined this entire process is, you simply click subscribe like so, and it automatically appears in the app ready for use. Wallpaper Engine can be used alongside any other Steam application, and you can turn off Steam after launching the program. The supported video formats are as follows. MP4, WebM, AVI, M4V, MOV, and WMV. It aims to deliver a live wallpaper while using as few system resources as possible. When using Wallpaper Engine, I've noticed that it consumes less memory than Google Chrome when in use, and it utilizes about 1-3% of CPU and GPU power depending on the resolution and frame rate of what you're running. With that said, you won't have to worry about it consuming too much resources at all unless you're running Unity on max settings in the background. Other apps that came before Wallpaper Engine attempted to do the same, but were not nearly as streamlined and efficient in terms of resource consumption. The software will not distract or hinder you while playing a game or working, as you can choose to automatically pause or completely stop the wallpaper while using another application or playing full screen including borderless and window mode. Various options to tweak quality and performance exist to make wallpaper engines suit your needs. As a general rule of thumb, 3D, 2D, and video-based wallpapers will perform best, while websites and applications will require more resources from your system. Having a dedicated GPU is highly recommended, but not required. Wallpaper engine is best used when creating your own wallpapers. One of the most popular ways to use it is to capture game footage and use it as a live wallpaper for Steam Engine. If you are a content creator or someone who's very artistic, I definitely recommend you pick up Wallpaper Engine, as it is really cheap right now on Steam. This will definitely add an extra layer of uniqueness and creativity to your setup. Thank you so much for watching guys, like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed this video. As always, I am your host, Paco MNL, and I'll catch you in a future video.